So we're here at the Bluetooth booth here at Seatec. And who are you? Uh, hello, my name is Eric Choi, Bluetooth SI. Welcome to Bluetooth World. Bluetooth so you have a whole bunch here. of Bluetooth demos? Sure, and, sure, uh, What's sure. the latest news happening with Bluetooth? Um, actually, we have development of many sensor devices and the application, like uh, the sports, fitness and medical devices. So we are very proud many support to members for IB Cross or um, but each e cash something. So it's very, very So a lot exciting. of the demos you have here, some cool, cool uh, products here with the... Uh, right. That is some robots we can control. This one, like this. It's really awesome. Yeah. And this is Bluetooth control. Sure. And this is a speaker. This is the magnetic field. Yeah, yes, magnetic field. And the Mipao. Yeah, uh, it's a play bird, play ball. control, right? And uh, this is also for the, oh, I'm sorry, this is in the yeah, garden. It's, yes, it's play bird. Oh, this is Bluetooth? Yes. Let's go around here. Bluetooth. What are those robots here? What are you showing with Mechano? It's very interesting, so can you open it now? Yeah. Okay. It's actually, he's an engineer for this company. Oh, yeah? Okay. So, so this is the Mechano robot. What does it do? So can you explain your product? What can it do? Um, here it makes some connection first. Yeah. It's connecting to it? Yes. <laughs> Alright, so he, he will control that robot through the... This is cool. <laughs> All this is Bluetooth control? Sure, absolutely. So is this some, uh, some new things happening with Bluetooth to make it easier, simpler, to that's set true, up and true. use? That is a poor specification for that too. It's a more easier connection and the longer better your life. So what uh, is the status with 4.2? It's still under the de development? Yeah, more security for the, the customer side and the low battery and the more powerful, the longer distance, there's more newer words for. Right. What are we looking at here? That is key players. So any the, uh, player can Here's a style, like uh, how much everything like this, yeah. right? The, the shape or... So this is for playing or for real? Um, you can go out and reel and you can... Uh, if you go out the mountainside yeah. and uh, take this camera and Bluetooth devices, he's, he can see his style through the, the web. All right, right, cool. And there we have the uh, Epson, the professional. Yes, yes, uh, uh, virtual. Grass. Yeah, virtual grass. Also using Bluetooth. Yes, correct. And if you connect with virtual grasses, and you can see any pictures from nice. these grasses through the Bluetooth technology. So let's check some of the. You have where do you have partners around here? Okay, we invited the nine members for here booth. So first of all, I would like to introduce the Lapis. All right. Hello. So hello. So Say hello. You're from a Lapis Semiconductor, and uh, what, is, what is this? Can you hold this? Uh, what is yeah. uh, our new product, uh, uh, Bluetooth Smart LSI and uh, Module? LSI and Module, so yeah. where can this go? It's very small. Yes. Is this an ARM CPU? Yes. ARM Cortex? Cortex M0 Plus. M0 Plus, yes. and can go in uh, smartwatch or where? Yes, smartwatch or uh, uh, many uh, healthcare wearable device. There are some uh, demonstration how it looks. And uh, what is this beacon? This is a beacon device. It's a conventional product. Conventional? Yes. All right, cool. All right, thank you. Okay. okay. And we'll meet the focus system. Yeah. Hey, how are you? So you have a small beacon, very, very small. Very small. How small is this? This tiny. And how, how long is the battery life? How long is the battery? One year. One year. One year. One year. One year battery. And we can see we can see inside the the PCB. Uh, somewhere. 
Okay. okay cool. yeah. There it is, ultra compact, very long battery life. Every three seconds you have a refresh. Beacons, very important. All right, you can even track a dog. Go in and out the house or tracking here. Proximity. Yes. Okay, yeah. thank you. Yes. Cool, alright. All right. Okay, coach is here. Uh, Okay. Hello. Right. Hi. We will do this So you have here Texas Instruments showing uh, uh, some there right here. Yeah. Right. Ah, no problem. No problem. Uh, so this is a ARM Cortex M3 solution. Right uh, here. With, uh, with the Bluetooth Low Energy. The yes. Bluetooth Low Energy in yeah. here. And uh, what is this for? Uh, yeah, this is for the uh, uh, this is for the microcontroller with uh, uh, Bluetooth. And uh, we have uh, the board for the several sensors on the board. Is this like a development kit? What is it, what is it for? Uh, it's uh, for the writing. Um, yeah. Running software? Yeah, with, uh, this is for the iPad and uh, we have an application uh, for this kit. And, uh, and yeah, so yeah. sorry, we already shut up. Shut no down, so, um, this, this guy works with the uh, iPad and uh, the data from the sensor can be captured by this application. Right. And uh, if, the, uh, if you want, you can um, pass this data into the cloud. The cloud nice. means, uh, for example, IBM, Microsoft kind of a server. Bluemix or other. Yes, and then it just guys. IoT solution. I would, yeah, true. Yes, IoT. IoT. All right. Cool. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank Thanks. you very much. Uh, also, here, the my conductor. Yeah. So. so we have here some solutions Nordic. So hello, yes. so who are you? Uh, I'm, uh, I'm a country manager of Japan from Nordic uh, Semiconductor. So what are you, are you talking about? ARM Cortex M4? Yes, this is our new chip. They just announced in June. Uh, uh, you call it the NR52 series. NR52? What series. does it do? Actually, this is a uh, Martes protocol uh, ultra low power uh, SOC, uh, which is cover the, uh, both of the Bluetooth Smart the AND, and also 2.4G proprietary. So all three in one? In one, yes. You can configure. Or you can choose one or the other? Or, or you can run two different protocols simultaneously. It's possible. You need two different antennas inside or? No, there's just one antenna. One it's antenna? It's all 2.4G. All right, so yeah. th there's already some products shown off using it? Or? Actually, it, uh, this 52 is brand new. Brand it's new? going to the production in this December. Are you showing it here? Yeah, this is uh, uh, the preview uh, development kit. Uh, this was the uh, previous one, it's called uh, NL51. So NL52 is an upgrade of the, uh, uh, this uh, SOC. What's the main improvement? Actually, the uh, processor has been improved to M4F from uh, uh, Cortex M0. So, so M0 to M4F? M4F. M4F. And also, the, uh, it has the uh, new process, the geometry process. It used to be 0.18 micron, but now this one is 55 nanometers, which is really small and power efficient. Uh, the first process. Very and small process. Also, the, this has the uh, brand new you know, the NFC tag on chip so that you can implement the touch to pair easily. Right. Is there something to do with uh, people can combine different things into one solution so it lowers the cost? Lowers the, the power? Of course, yes, see that because the, currently many of the products for the Bluetooth Smart has been implemented by two chips. One is Bluetooth Smart and the extended processor. Now the people can integrate those solutions onto one chip, which is NF52. All right, cool. Thanks a lot. Yeah. Thank you. Thanks. Okay. Let's move to Alicia. Hey. Hello. How are you? So, uh, what is what are you showing here? Uh, the Alicia. What is this machine? Uh, this is a Bluetooth analyzer. So, uh, Bex 400 can capture all Bluetooth. 79 channels together, concurrently. 79 channels? Uh, yes, and also uh, low energy 40 channels. So this is showing all the different Bluetooth around us? Yes. All these? Yes, all Bluetooth devices around here. There's many? Yeah, too many, because the exhibition. Yeah. <laughs> Bluetooth is there, a, is there a solution with uh, Bluetooth where 
it doesn't care so much about interference? Can they all work together? There's, there's hundreds of Bluetooth devices sure, in this hall. They, all of them work? They could connect each other, right? That means yeah. a secure, that is Bluetooth advantage, I mean, strong point, <laughs> secure connections. So what is the solution for? Who, who would use this? Ah, for the developer and also uh, test engineer. Testing, all right. Yeah. Cool, thank you. Right. Thanks. And here. Hello. Hi, hi how are you? Hi. So, uh, this is, uh, what are you showing here? Vision context? Uh, this is a distributor for uh, our world private company. So, uh, what, what is this solution here? It's a uh, location management for human or just uh, when uh, elderman or kids uh, yeah. out of the home. Uh, this this system uh, alerts the uh, alert, uh, system, alerts uh, the okay. signal to uh, smartphone or uh, display. All right, and some bunch of uh, trackers? Yes. Are those uh, uh, key lost? Uh, yes, yes. Uh, okay. This band or this tag. Cool, thanks. Thank thanks you. a lot. Thank, Thank you. you. All right. Cool. In the rest one. Hey. Hey. Oh. How are you? Yeah. Hey. Uh, can you explain what, what what what's going on here? So hello. So uh, what what is this company? Applex. Applex. Yeah. This basically we are producing this kind of module using Bluetooth chip. Um, each distance with three kinds of beacon units. So it's beacons. Beacons. Those are beacons. Each one. All right. So, what is the idea here? You can put it in the supermarket. Touch it. Touch it. Then smartphone catch it. Then order something. Nice. You could have it around in the store and push and get something happen there. Then order to point that. If you want to buy. Yes. I'm sure we can get also discount coupon as well. It's right. very good, right? It's okay. Uh, Thank you. You can see some menu, menu, yeah, and very useful for yeah. visitors to get. And here, this also is this a different demo? Oh. What is this about? So the idea is we want to. We want to do with the home apparatus companies equipped with those modules. Yes, so what what is it for? Uh, for it says when the coffee is ready. Coffee is ready to to know the yeah. smartphone. Then get the okay. Then use it. Get the all right information. That cool. means you can make a copy through the, your smartphone. If nice. you look at if you in the, your bedroom. Yeah. Or the outside, and if you want to take some coffee, you just push the button from the, your smartphone, and the smartphone can send a message to coffee machine, right? And nice. the coffee machine makes some new fresh coffee, nice. and that is ready for you. Can we talk a little bit more about the future of Bluetooth? You are, you're working on Bluetooth Mesh also. Yeah, what is we, that about? Yeah, the Mesh is a step of the way. That means we can control a bunch of devices simultaneously over the the. To periodically, so example in the bulb in the house, like a few hundreds or thousand, not sure thousand, but we can control that the bulb in From one phone. Years. Yes, smartphone. How much is the bandwidth lower, or is it just for signaling, or it could also be for music, or? Um, not sure for music. We just think about at yeah, this moment we can just control the bulb or something like that, so not the music. Not this is under sure. development. And 4.2 is coming also later, soon? That is the new version, not 4.2. 4.2 yeah. is already adopted. That the mesh will be adopted for new course with because version in next year. Right. So the name is not fixed yet, but we will announce in later.